Hi guys, in this video, I'll be teaching you how to add networked hit sounds to your Gorilla Tag fan game. Now, network hit sounds are pretty much just hit sounds, but they're networked, meaning other people will be able to hear your hit sounds. Just like in Gorilla Tag, the script was made by Boss, so huge shout out to him. All of his credits and stuff are in the description. The script for this will be my Discord server, link in the description. It'll also be in a Google Drive file link, also link in the description. If you need any help with this, make sure to join my Discord server, link in the description. And that's a cool community to be in. Anyways, let's get straight into the video. So here we are on our project. First of all, of course, you need to get the script. So either from my Discord server or from the link in the description, get the script. It's called Better Hit Sounds right here. So you can just drag it into your project or right click, click import new asset and then find it. Just import it to your project. Now how this works, I'm gonna use the floor for an example. So let's say I wanna add a grass hit sound to the floor here. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go to tag, click add tag. And here in the tags, you kinda just wanna make a tag for all your different things. So for example, I'm gonna have one for grass, I'm gonna have one for rock. Maybe I'm gonna have one for metal or something. Just have a tag for all the different things, you know? Like maybe keyboard buttons, if you want other people to be able to hear your keyboard buttons. Probably not, but you know, whatever. I'll just shoot these for now. And then put the tag on anything that you want on network. So for example, here on the grass, I'm going to put the grass tag on it here on the walls i'm gonna put the rock on it and why not here on this i'm gonna put the metal on it now you want to go to your gorilla rig go to gorilla player okay so go to your left hand or right hand controller and what you want to do select them both add the better hit sound script onto it then go to your left hand controller and check the left controller box now select your left hand and your right hand controller click add components and search for audio source and you're just going to add an audio source now on this make sure play on awake is turned off and now on left hand controller which says audio source here just drag in your left hand controller and on right hand controller which says audio source drag in right hand now go back and select them both and on the better hit sounds thing open up tag sounds and I'm just gonna click the plus here. For the first one, for the tag, I'm just gonna put in grass. I'm gonna make another one. I'm gonna name it rock. And for the last one, I'm gonna name it metal. Make sure you spell it the exact same as the name of the actual tag. Now you need some hit sounds. And what's really cool about this, you can do many hit sounds. So instead of it just playing the same one over and over, unless you have like three of them, it'll randomly pick one of the three when you hit the ground. So it doesn't just play the same sound over and over. But anyways, find some hit sounds. You know, if you want, you could record them yourself or you could just find them from online. For example, I have a hit sound here, so I'm going to go back there, and I'm just going to drag it in for sounds. I'm just going to use the same one for all of them for now. As I said, you can do many for one, so let's say, you know, I do this, another audio thing. It'll have a 50-50 chance between when you hit the ground, it'll either play this one or this one. Then, once again, make sure you have both of the controllers selected, both of the hands, and you're going to add a photon view, and then just click on photon view, and then just leave the settings as it is. And now we're all done. So make sure to save and... Let's test this out. So now, as you can see, if we hit our hand, it plays the hit sound. I made all the hit sounds the same sound, but they work. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Make sure to like and subscribe because it helps me out so much. The script for this will be in the description, in my Discord server, and in the Google Drive file link. Also, please consider becoming a channel member because it's only $2 a month. And for that price, you get so many awesome perks, including getting a shout out at the end of every single video that I make, just like the people on the screen right now. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. And yeah, guys, that's it for me today. Peace.